All right. So welcome to our Wednesday night team call, y'all. Um, I wanted to just start out um, with something a little bit fun before we kind of jump into the details. Who can tell me something exciting that is going on with your Plexus business right now? And I will start calling out some names. Anything. If you, if you posted and you're getting some likes, anything exciting that's going on with your Plexus business right now? I talked to a friend today who um, I had no idea lost her job. And um, she is willing to join my team. So I think that's exciting. She used to be with another MLM, but she doesn't make any money with it. So I'm like, uh, you're going to totally make some money over here. Hop on over. So I think she's joining. Awesome. Anyone else? Exciting things that are happening in your Plexus business. Um, I would have to say that I have a really exciting prospect. Um, she and her husband lead a huge, huge, huge Facebook group. Um, it's about a half a million followers and members. And I actually sent some products to her because she struggles with MS. Um, so I'm going to be following up with her in about a week just to see how she's feeling. Awesome. All right. One more person. Something exciting that's going on in your Plexus business right now. I can say. Um, can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So what's exciting is that even though I'm not 100% on track for this retreat, I'm still, being, still having faith. And keeping the faith and pushing forward that I will make the points I need for this month, next month, and to make up from last month to make it for the usual treat. That's number one. And number two is I had one of my rock stars to come to um, our meeting a couple weeks ago. And she has voice mm -hmm. interest in the products and possibly the business. So that's really exciting for me because, you know, with that person being on my chicken list, um, mm -hmm. it was really big. That they're interested in considering joining, so I'm really excited about that. And I know I'm not going to say anything, so I'm going to say something for her. LaKendra has jumped in. She is starting to post. She's talking to people. She is already like hit the ground running on a great, amazing start. So I, I I'm excited. I don't know. I'm excited. LaKendra, you should have shared that. That's exciting. <laughs> That's awesome, girl. All right. Um, well, the reason I opened up with that is because I think a lot of times we get so laser focused on, you know, just, oh, this person is not responding to me or, you know, I followed up with this person and they're not, you know, following back up with me or, you know, I'm not as far along in my business as I, as I'd like to be. Don't focus on that, you know, um, focus on the exciting things that are happening. Focus on the people that are expressing interest. Focus on your own personal, you know, health results. Um, focus on all of the exciting things and promotions um, that are happening on our team. Focus on those things to keep, to keep you going, keep you motivated. So, we said before that this is a really exciting month and it really is. And so um, we did have a team call last week, um, but some new things kind of happened over the last week. So we wanted to get on a call again um, tonight just to make sure that everybody is in the loop and you kind of know everything that's going on. Okay. So starting with um, our silver promotion um, contest that's going on. Um, so, you may or may not know, but silver is the first sort of big promotion with Plexus. And when you achieve silver, that means you have personally sponsored three ambassadors. So you have three people under you that have joined your team, either as you know someone who just wants the products wholesale or someone who wants to link arms with you and work the business. Okay, just three people. Um, this month and this month only, in addition to the $100 bonus that you get when you, when you promote to Silver, 
Plexus is giving another $100 bonus. So basically a double bonus for promoting to silver this month. Okay. Which is huge. Okay. So um, you right out the gate, just for sponsoring three people, make $200 in addition to your business building bonuses. So every time that you sign someone up and they order a welcome pack, um, you get $25 or $50, depending on which welcome pack they ordered. So say they ordered, all three people order a $25, or sorry, a $99 welcome pack, then you get $25 each time. So right there is $275, okay? Um, and that doesn't include, you know, any commissions that you may earn uh, for people who uh, order from you as a customer. So, you guys, this is your month to promote to silver. If you are not yet silver, you have maybe no, no one under you or you have one or two people, this is your month. So, um, we want to do everything we can to help you find those three people that want to join you on this health journey, okay? And the way to do that... One way to do that, I should say, um, this is a good segue, is the seven day challenge that's coming up. So our seven day challenge is basically um, a, well, we're calling it an experience this time around, but basically it's, you know, you have someone order a $25 or $24.95 uh, seven day trial of Plexus Slim and then we plug them into a closed or a private group where each day we share product information, live testimonials, we do giveaways, um, you know, we, there's even a post where people get to, you know, kind of share their, um, their testimony, their pleximony, um, but it is a really, really great way for people to um, learn all about Plexus, okay, and um, but the deal is, and it's really, really easy because to get people plugged into it because most people can kind of wrap their, their head around spending $25. You know, they want to, they kind of want to try it out. They want to see will they like the taste. Does it work for anyone else? And that is what the challenge does. Okay. And so um, we have, I have a, a message that I send people and I posted it on my team page. All you need to do is create your list of people. And when I say a list of people, it does not need to be five people. You need to go through your Facebook friends list, your phone list, all, you know, and create a list of at least 100 people. That, that's, that's the challenge, you guys, because this is, this is a numbers game, right? This is a relationship business, but it's a numbers game. So if you reach out to five people, you may not get anyone that is willing to, to join the challenge. But if you reach out to 100 people, you may get 10 people that are interested in the challenge, right? And it's really not difficult because, again, like I said, it is, it's, it's a matter of just copying, paste, copying and pasting a message. Um, you know, hey, my team is doing this um, seven-day challenge experience. You get to learn more about Plexus and so on and so forth. You know, are you willing to give it a go? And some people may not respond. Some people say, yeah, sure, I'll try it. $25, that's not bad. Um, so I know several of you um, participated or had people participate in the seven-day challenge last month, and it resulted in ambassadors. So um, if you have not started that yet, that process of inviting people and getting, you know, trying to get people plugged into that challenge, I implore you to start tonight because it is really, truly a great way uh, for you to build your business, okay? And again, going back to that, um, that going silver challenge, it is another tool for you um, to go silver and get that double bonus this month, okay? Um, the other thing that's really cool is so Lakendra, say you um, sign up someone as a, an ambassador uh, this month and then they join you and they say, okay, you know, this is cool. Like I want to work my business too. And then they go silver. So every time you help someone or any of us help someone go silver that's under us on our team, then you get a $50, another $50 bonus. 
okay? So that's another incentive to link arms with the people on your team and really help them go silver as well. Okay. It's saying my connection is unstable. Can you guys hear me? Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay, I, there are a couple other things, but I just wanna stop there and make sure um, you guys don't have any questions or do you understand what I'm saying? Raise your hand if you're going silver this month. <laughs> Come on, I don't see any hands raised. Well, Kendra, your hand, shut it up. Put your hand up. Come on now. <laughs> Anyone who has not gone silver should be raising their hand right now. Haley, Lacey, okay, thank you, uh, Lacey, for raising your hand. All right, all right, Lori, thank you. All right. Chandra is on there too. Chandra, I know you can do it too, girl. So, all right. Um, so we actually, a, a couple of us just got off of uh, a call with um, Diamond Ambassador, uh, Timmy Yancey. And she, um, she just gave us some amazing just tips on, um, you know, building relationships because again this that's what this is this is the relationship business and so if people think you're just chasing them just to you know earn money or you know they think that you just are talking to them because you know you want them to join your team then they will they will run right and so um, one thing that she said that I loved is that 90% of your time should be spent investing in people and 10% of your time should be spent closing and what she meant by that is, you know, sometimes you can just reach out to people and say, hey, you know, I think you'd be great for my team. But other times, you know, you just have to keep kind of planting seeds and like living on people. So if you see someone post, you know, a cute picture of themselves or a cute picture of their kid or, you know, their pet or whatever, you know, comment, you know, you look great, you look beautiful, love your outfit. Um, your kids are so cute. I mean, make sure that it's authentic. Like if their kid isn't cute, don't say that. Um, but y'all know what I mean. Um, and so, you know, really spend time investing in, in people. And then when the time comes for you to talk to them about the business or talk to them about trying the products, they're not as apt to you know run and be like oh i'm not going to respond to her because she's just you know she's just trying to get my money or whatever even though we know that that's not what this really is really about um and so keep that in mind as you're reaching out to people and inviting people to the seven day challenge and you know even beyond this month um as you're building your business it is it is a relationship business and it is all about um you know investing in people so uh and then Let's see, the last thing I wanted to touch on is, um, and we talked about this last week as well, but probably every time we get on a team call, um, we'll be talking about this, but it is signing ambassadors up on the phone. So we're, we're having this issue kind of team-wide, not just on our team, but in Robin's kind of big extended team, where there are people that are signing up without a welcome pack, or no, I'm sorry, without their uh, convenience order on. Um, and so what that does is the following month when um, it's time for their order um, to process or ship, it's not going to because they never set up a future order or a convenience order. And so as we're all trying to build our teams, that's just not a good way to kind of build your team. Um, because there, I don't know what the statistic is, I don't know, 50-50 or 60-40, where if someone doesn't have a convenience order set up uh, initially, it's very, it's not likely that they will ever get one set up. You know, they'll, they may kind of willy-nilly take the products, and then when you try to reach out to them about getting their convenience order set up, they're like, ah, I don't know, you know, um, because they have in their mind, like, okay, well, I was able to sign up, and I didn't have to set this thing up, and so, you know, I'm not going to worry about it. And so, um, again, the way that you avoid that is getting them on the phone and walking them through the sign-up process and making sure that they don't skip that screen, that convenience order screen. 
Um, and so we have, we actually have um, a couple of, or uh, well, it's like a document that you can use to guide you um, in guiding them through the sign up process. Um, because obviously you're not going to be able to see what they see, but you know, you can kind of follow that document and make sure that, you know, they're going step by step and kind of signing up uh, correctly. So we'll make sure that we post that on our on our team pages after tonight's call. And hey, I'll also say if you are signing someone up and you are having an issue with a social security number, which sometimes happens, or anything like that, do not hesitate at that moment to like reach out to one of us because it's usually an easy fix, but you know, if you don't know what the fix is, you could potentially miss out on that customer or have a hard time getting them back on the phone. So um, do not hesitate to be like, hold on one second or just kind of elongate the conversation and shoot us a quick text. We will respond and we will help you through whatever the little hitch is. Yeah, yeah. Well, and the, the main issue there with the social security number is they have to, like once they enter their social, they have to click verify SSN or it's gonna keep kicking back. And so I found that, you know, when I'm on the phone and I'm walking them through signing up, I always say, okay, hit that button or click that button and nine times out of 10, that's what the issue is. So, you know, before they even get down and to finish the rest of that page, make sure that they've hit that verify SSN uh, button. And, uh, and they also, sorry, Angela, you like also have to make sure that their um, name on their social security card matches the name that they're putting on their, um, as they're entering into the system as well. Yeah. So my name is not Elena Mays in the system, um, in the system because that's not my name on my social security card. It's Elena Freeman. So um, just keep an eye out and watch out for that too because that's sometimes an issue. Also keep an eye out for people who have multiple names out here in the streets like <laughs> Elena. <laughs> yeah. You can't trust them. You can't trust them. I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. Um, and the very last um, a promotion that I wanted to share with you guys is um, one that Robin is um, running for her first three levels. Um, so that would include me. So I'm her level one. Um, Jacqueline uh, is her level two. So Jacqueline's under me. And then Elena would be her level three. Um, so it would be anyone under um, me, and then anyone under any of my level ones would qualify for this promotion. Um, and basically the promotion is, um, it's, she's calling it like a $5 match. And so for, um, if you sign someone up or you have someone that's interested in signing up as an ambassador, um, she'll give $5 and then you give $5. And then essentially we're giving that person $10 off of uh, their welcome pack, um, which is similar to the promotion that Plexus uh, ran last month. Um, so just keep that in mind as well um, as you are um, out there, you know, just sharing Plexus with, with people and, you know, you have people that are interested in, in joining and signing up with a welcome pack. Um, and that actually will go through the 13th. Uh, which I'm not even sure what day that is. Uh, so next next Thursday, the 13th. Okay. So um, one more quick thing on the seven day challenge. Um, I would say to have your uh, potential challengers order their trial from you or their seven day trial pack from you um, no later than Wednesday, uh, July 12th, which is a week from today, and that will pretty much ensure that they'll get their, their product before we start the challenge on the 17th. Um, I will also say, though, that if you have someone who orders late, um, that's okay. As long as they order, we can add them to the challenge group, and they'll just probably get their product a little bit late, and you know they'll start a little bit late. Um, so we have that happen sometimes, too. 
So if you have someone that's like, you know, I had a, a, a girl last month where like, it was like the day or two before the challenge started. And she was like, oh, my bad. I didn't get back with you. I said, nope, it's not too late. Here's my website. Go ahead and order. And um, I, I added her. And, you know, like I said, she was a little bit late starting, but um, she got the full challenge experience or the, you know, the full challenge experience still because um, she put her in the group from the beginning. So um, don't let people off the hook that easily. Okay. Anything else? Any other questions y'all have? Um, any other, anything else exciting that you want to share? I have actually a couple of exciting things that happened over the weekend that I want to share with you guys, but I want to let you guys go first. Okay. All right. So for me, I had, um, there's a girl, uh, if, if you're not on mute, would you mind putting yourself on mute? Let's see. Okay, uh, there's some background noise. Okay, let's see, mute some people here. All right, so there's a girl that I know, I um, actually know, knew her husband in college, and yeah, I think that's you, Elena. Let me mute you. Okay, um, I knew her husband in college, and he, um, we have, you know, similar friends and, you know, all of that, similar network. So anyway, she has this, um booming instagram page she was even actually featured recently on um good morning america as uh, a mom who has these like fashionable kids and all that right and i think she has like 44 or 45 thousand followers on instagram or something like this something crazy and so um she posted that she um has issues with cystic acne around her chin and something told me to just reach out to her. Like, you know what, what do I have to lose? So I reached out to her and I just said, you know what, I wanna gift you something. Uh, uh, DM me your home address, which I'm sure she gets hit up left and right from all kinds of people. Within, literally within five minutes, she was like, your ears must have been burning. I was just talking to someone and they told me that you are passionate about Plexus and Plexus may be able to help me. Here's my address. So I was like, well, look at the Lord, look at that. So anyway, she, um, she got the product uh, two days ago, I think. And um, she shouted me out on her Instagram stories and um, she's getting started today. So I'm really excited about that. Um, I am very hopeful that she will um, love the product and that she will join my team and she'll blow it up and be really successful with Plexus. And so you have to speak those things into existence and I believe it will happen. Um, and then the second uh, exciting thing that happened for me, I had um, a, a girl, um, she's actually a cousin of a friend of mine. And you know, and this is exactly why your presence on social media is so, so important. Um, people are, people are trolling. People are following us. They may not like or comment our Plexus stuff, but they are watching. And case in point, I had, uh, my cousin or my friend's cousin reached out to me seconds after she liked, uh, a, a picture that I had posted from convention. And maybe like a couple minutes later, she said, I have, um, I have candida issues. And I heard Plexus can help that. Can you send me some information? I said, well, I sure can. I sure can send you some information. And so um, that is exciting because, and the reason that's exciting is people are finally starting to connect our, like all the issues that we have with our health and all the ailments and everything else that we're dealing with to the gut and then subsequently connecting gut health and gut issues to Plexus. And so over time, you guys, because this is still a ground floor opportunity, over time, people are going to start, you know, we're doing so much of like the cold reach outs now, you know, have you heard of Plexus? Would you like to try it? You want to try my, or you want to join my seven day challenge? Eventually people are going to be seeking us out just like this girl. Like, tell me more about this. How can this help me? 
And so I just really encourage y'all to keep um, sharing boldly, um, keep focusing on, on your own health and having your own story to tell. And eventually people are going to just start flocking to us and, and all of our businesses are going to blow up. But the key is, are you going to be around when that happens? Right. And so um, I really hope that you all are still around so that you can see that success and so that you can continue helping people. So, um, yeah, that's what I that's all I got tonight. Anyone else have anything to share before we wrap up? Keep, looks like one of y'all are trying to ask a question. You have to unmute yourself. Okay, I think she was trying to ask a question. I'm not sure. Okay. Um, all right. Well, if you don't have any questions, you know we're always available. Our team pages is a great way or a great place to answer questions or answer questions, ask questions as well. Um, and I'm excited for all of your businesses this month and. Just keep plugging away, keep working. All right, y'all have a great, great, great night.